Hey everybody, welcome to Speed Bump. We got the last game of 2020 here for you. December's game, new game reveal tonight. Uh, we're looking for the race format again, right? We're gonna do that again. Yeah, I think uh, this time around we're gonna do uh, another race just like the previous one. So whoever has the best race time for our, our wrap up race will be the winner. Yeah, that worked pretty well, I think. I was pretty happy with it. And uh, I think it increases participation too. But this one's a real short one. I don't want to talk about it too much. Let's take a look at what it is. Be ready for that reveal, everybody. Monster Mars is complete Fiona one, by the way, right? Uh, mm -hmm. We have that race wrapped up, so. Yeah. I yeah, gotta Fiona, get Ivy, then Eric's, I believe, were the top three. I got to get that marked down on the website, which uh, is going to be updated with this. <laughs> of this arcade art. <laughs> there he is. Super Conversion Kit. The name of the game. High action adventure. A dangerous group of evil criminals have taken has taken people and are holding them as hostages. Musashi, a master of ninjutsu and other martial arts, fights single-handedly in the opponent's territory on a mission to rescue the hostages and wipe out the band of villains. Game features the method of offensive combat automatically changes, allowing the player to utilize the punch and kick for enemies near and the shuriken, still throwing blades, etc. for those far away. Five missions, each consisting of three to four stages, take the player through a rich assortment of scenes, high speed action, a variety of weapons, unique enemies, and a wide array of ninjutsu techniques combined to give you the maximum and playing experience enjoyment. Hope you have fun playing with ninja stars. Still throwing blades. Sorry, still throwing blades. Uh, the charity's complete. Let me get that off screen, though. Though I'm very happy with that amount. Uh, we, we were there in that one. Uh, world record is Hurricane Mixer 1308. That's not an it's not an old run. That's pretty new. Uh, but um, I'll tell you this: the long play of this game is like 15 and a half minutes. I don't know how much long play cheated. <laughs> it may not have. I, this game is just not very long, is what I'm saying. Uh, so if you're yeah. looking for a quick one to jump in a race on, this one, we could do five races in an hour, maybe. <laughs> it's just really fast. Uh, so Arthur Boo's going to be playing it. I will play it a little bit. Um, it seems... So I, I used to speedrun the NES Shinobi a long time ago. Um, this one seems like it's a little more brutal. Uh, so I'm interested in seeing how it plays. Um, this one might be one of those ones where if you're going to participate blind in the race at the end of the month, you may have to play pretty conservatively to complete it. Because uh, it does fully game over when you run out of lives, it seems like. And uh, you only get one hit before you before you die. There's no health bar. So. Are you ready? Um, one second. Okay. Yeah, I gotcha. I'll get that audio bump. Okay. Do you need me to turn it up on my end? Anything like that? Yeah, it sounds low. Uh, that is about the best I can do without it getting too loud for me. All right. It's not too bad. Ah, uh, so okay. ready for Shinobi. I got a clock for you. All right. Well, we'll see how this goes. I'm going to try to play pretty conservatively because I'm worried about fully game overing, but yeah. let's just see how it goes. So in at least the Nest Shinobi, which seems to be very, very similar to this one, um, you don't have to save the hostages. And in fact, um, saving the hostages costs you time at the end of each level, so you skip them typically. Uh, this one, however, uh, the the boss doesn't appear until you've, you've uh, saved the hostages, so you definitely have to. Yeah, I, I read that on the uh, the thing I was just reading there. It, it mentioned that hostages were mandatory. A lot of these bosses have hitboxes on their head, and hitting them doesn't do anything. I've noticed. It's one of the things I noticed when I was watching some of this. Yeah, this is this is pretty much the arcade version, yeah. Uh, this is the PC engine version, so it's going to be very similar to that. There's Spider-Man. What? What is he? Spider-Man's doing his best. 
Why is he, uh, why is he on the wrong team? What's he doing? Maybe he's confused. Uh, do you know what that, does that save in the bottom left light up or something? Uh, it's telling me how many more hostages I need to save in this level. So there's one face, so that means I have to save one more hostage. And once I do uh, save all the hostages, then I can exit the level. So it's not just completely going left or right. You do have to slow down and, and save hostages wherever they are. Yeah, and the boss ends up being in their own little area. Nice. Okay. Spider-Man dropped on my head. He got clonked. How much HP do you have? Uh, like zero. If you if you touch an enemy, you just bounce off. But like bullets and knives and things, for the most part, kill you instantly. It seems like. Well, I think I got enough points for an extra life. That's good because I was down to my last life. We were looking for something a little simpler. This is a, what is this, a two-button game? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, we wanted oh my to, god, he got me again! We wanted to break it up after last time. Maybe you could jump off the box and nail him. Maybe. Need to come up with something new, because I'm just getting dunked on here. Shinobi's a big series. I don't know if this is related to Shinobi 3 popular Genesis one, uh, but uh, maybe it is. Maybe it's just called Shinobi, though. That sounds more likely. <laughs> what is he throwing at you? A fireball, I guess? Is that a steel throwing blade? Okay. I think this is the boss. Oh, man. Boss pal. <laughs> boss pal. Boss pal. Yeah, this game's not very long, so even though it is a little on the harder side, it's not going to matter much. I'm going to be able to lock this down. So the question is whether or not there's any way to pick up from a game over, or whether or not it's a full game over. No, it's letting me continue at least, so looks maybe like I have a limited level. number of continues? Hey, you got some credits, it looks like. I saw that up there. I didn't feel like this game was impossibly hard, <laughs> but uh, we might even consider some uh, some methods to make it easier if we need them, but I don't think it's that hard, especially with the length of it being like 10 minutes. Yeah, I'm not too terribly worried about it, now that I know that there's continues. Way to defeat Ken O. Who's next? Mandara. Ah, the, the boss after Mandara whips. Oh, you weren't... Okay, I, I thought you were dead. Told you. I did, I got tricked. Oh, they, they don't die in one hit. God. <laughs> <laughs> the final boss in this game is called the Masked Ninja. Uh, I don't know if the arcade version has another stage beyond him. He's a pretty dopey looking green ninja man. Not as dopey as these ninjas, though. Oh, he, he bonked me. I've, I've been relatively successful so far um, just jumping in and jumping out of the background or, you know, upper level. But he just, uh, he pushed me back. He said, no. You're trained in ninjutsu and other martial arts, and this is the best you can do. Apparently. <laughs> other martial arts. <laughs> that bullet was hidden behind the, the icon at the bottom of the screen. I saw it. I saw it way too late. So my hope is once again everyone will be better at this game than I am. <laughs> I'm gonna give this one a shot. Uh, so we'll be having a race next week, folks. So you got time to... Uh... You got... You got gotta get... guy. He's too low to hit. Can you go along the, the top? Is that off, an option? Yeah, I think, I think I'm gonna stay on the top here. Oh my god, he had two hit points. The hostage face looks like a, a Met who's smoking a cigar. Man. 
I think the path is up over the first guy and then down and then up again. I'm just trying to figure out how you would safely get through here quickly and it seems to me like there were some there were some holes in their swarm. Yeah, the, the nest version of this was really, really basic. Like it was almost entirely just run left or right, don't stop for anything. Uh, this one looks like it's gonna have a lot more of, you know, it might be worthwhile to switch switch sides quite often. I saw those dudes have a reload animation. He just got the cross up on the blue. No, we're not a mass ninja. We're just a guy. We have knee pads and elbow pads and that's it. We're just a Musashi. A guy named Musashi. That guy's dangerous, man. Well, there is a world record to watch. Uh, four optimal path. We're not looking it's to beat pretty, the world record, but uh, I mean, it's pretty fast. Yeah, I mean, you could. You would have already been halfway through it just watching what we've done so far. Let me see your credits. You got one left. I can give this game a shot after you're done if you want. Yeah, go ahead. Set up for it. Let me see here. I keep thinking I'm just going to rush past them, but I would really need to know where all the enemies are spawning if I'm going to try to rush past anything. A different power? I have a different icon on mine. Maybe uh you use only the Japanese version? Yeah. Yeah, the Japanese ROM is the one I found. You have some kind of superpower. I'm watching the yeah. demo. Did you know about that? I didn't know about that. Yeah, I didn't know how to activate it. I tried to see whether or not I could switch my power because you said you saw a different icon, and so I hit uh the select button on what whatever that button's called on the Turbo Graphics 16. Uh, and that activated it, so that's how you do it. My bad, I didn't mean to cover your screen up there. I was setting up, and I was blocking you. We're good. You still working on this level? And with the wind. my best. You have to kill that guy? That guy's optional, right? You just have to save the hostages, then you can bail. Yeah, Presumably. if I could get past all these ninjas at the end, they keep getting me. Just they touch you, and you're just dead. The green ones don't phase in until you get like in between them. Uh, so this is a turbo graphics game, so don't hit select because it'll reset the game, right? Um, I don't remember. Is that the way it works with Turbo Graphics 16? I think so. I'll find out. I think sometimes it does. It doesn't seem to be the case this time. I still got continues. Looks like you got a decent number of continues. If you if you know what you're doing, you should be able to complete this game on the set of continues you're provided. Yep, the world record has uh, no deaths, I think. Which is, that's probably all it took <laughs> to get it. Uh, just just being that good at it. That blue ninja man. He's such a tough guy. See what I'm talking about? They 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 get on they're on either side of you when they spawn in. Yeah, there's gotta it's be tough. a way to sneak past. I'm sure the world record does. Yeah, you wouldn't want to fight any of these guys unless you had to. Oh my. Too close. You gotta dance with him if you don't get close to him. Oh, 
Looks like once they're gone, they're gone. <laughs> they're on either side of you. What do you want me to do? A difficult position. All right, you're at 11 minutes and 40 seconds. All right, all right, your turn. All right, I'll give it a shot. Let's see here. I'll restart my timer here. Let me let me get my name up there as well. I've been exposed as a fake gamer. By Shinobi of all games. Really intense title screen. All right. I'm gonna restart my clock here. Get four credits, looks like. So how do you use a superpower? Uh, for me, it was my button that was mapped to select. Okay. And you can jump into the foreground and background by holding up when you jump or down. Yeah. Sneaky. <laughs> All that Hades training I... paid off for me there with that good reflex onto, into the bullet. I love how the music just... It goes pretty hard. It's, it, it's very good music, and then suddenly you get shot and the music just stops. They, they, couldn't have put a, they, they couldn't have put a finer point on you messing up than just having the music die instantly. I like this guy just leaving. I'm fast with him. <laughs> hey, newbie, thanks for this. Alright. Ken O, I'm coming for you, buddy. That's a lot of dudes. I just watched you do this. I'm still. In... Oh no! <laughs> I, was, I hit the I hit the start button instead of the. Cast, Learn from my mistakes. I, and I I paused on the frame that I was dying to Spider Man. I love how that guy just takes a shot straight into the box. Mr. Swords, come on! How do you deal with Mr. Swords? Huh. Huh. What a jerk, Mr. Swords! <laughs> I think you can get back if he tries to throw the swords, it's a projectile, so... He's on guard. <laughs> Head empty, he was given one job, it was, it was protect this hostage. I got it, you jump on his head and you stun him a little bit. What a jerk. Oh, the purple ones don't throw the sword? Oh! That one throws the sword. That one does. He doesn't reappear either. It looks like he's gone. I almost pulled it off. I was trying to get the Spider-Man. I should've just cast my spell. Did you get that? Do you, do you find that? How come it changed to the wind? I don't know. I guess you acquire it at some point? Looks like you start with wind. I don't know what... I had a different one when I began for sure. It was an illusion attack and it's not what I got now. I have to investigate a little bit. So the, uh, the game description already being deceitful because there's only one extra... There's just two levels in stage one, not four or three or whatever. I've been defeated by a cube. He just threw a ventilator at me. An entire shaft. <laughs> okay, you definitely had to hit him in the visor, right? Yeah, yeah, you have to hit him in the face or else it doesn't count. 
And he'll like, his animation makes it obvious when he gets hit. That was pretty obvious that he got hit. <laughs> it's a robot. Wee wee. All right. Come on, Keno. Get out of there. All right, let's see if I can do this. <laughs> well, I let's give it a this, better throw. This is this is great because it's making me feel really vindicated. He's a tough ninja. I robbed him. Hostage guard, unemployed now. That man had a family. Uh. Not bad, not bad. Not bad. Get out of here, ninja. I should have used this on the hard guys. The fellas. <laughs> Almost. I'm gonna save that yeah, for the I fellas. Th I think you'll get past them. The fellow that comes out at the start is the worst. I'll get him. I stunned the ninja. There's just so many enemies on screen all the time. That's true. Ah, I couldn't get away from it. I was close. You should be able to just jump up on top of the box there, um, instead of trying to change to the background. Yeah. I've just been avoiding enemies where I can. I love that dude's reload animation, it's the best. <laughs> God, these, these ninjas are easily the threat. They are super mean. You can't jump on them because they are all on defense all the time. Everyone else you can bounce off of and stun. But uh, the the special attack definitely will work on the on the two dudes. So I think that's the play. It's got to be. Huge ninja energy from this dude. All right. I might have jumped the gun. Nope, I'm good. Nice. They're vulnerable. Well, it looks like you're in there. Is Stay there clear. a cost for using the magic? It's got one use on the bottom right, and it's, it's randomly changing. It's a lightning bolt now. Oh. Maybe it's like specific to the level? Oh, that guy sucks. <laughs> that guy's a jerk. Hoisted. This is the level I saw originally. It seemed alright. Just like pipes, man. Purple sword man just gives up. He just quits. You just gotta know where these boys are, man. They're just, they're just yeah. Mean. They sneak up on you. Can we jump down there? Nah, I gotta. The rest of these jokers aren't much. That sneaky blue ninja. I'm ready for him this time. <laughs> Can't wait for him to get you again. No, you least no expect it. It'll have to be a different sneaky ninja. That that was a sneaky ninja, but he's late. I don't think he can come after me. Too fast. No! <laughs> I should have hit the select button faster. I was on it. I was I had my finger ready. Gotcha, Spider-Man. Now, I will say, 
most uh, TurboGrafx-16 games, um, a lot of them don't benefit from it, so this may not end up mattering, but the TurboGrafx-16 controller comes with turbo functionality, like the name would suggest, and uh, most of the time speedruns uh, allow it because it's a stock controller, and so there's really no reason to ban it. Yeah. Um, so if you find a strat that works well with the turbo controller, if you want to just hold down the button to fire uh, spinning metal blades, <laughs> what was it? What was it? The game called them? Shurikens. <laughs> no, I mean the. Fuck you, Spider-Man. Yeah, what's up? I can't believe you survived that one. Steel throwing blades, thank you. I see you just want to hold down a turbo button to throw throw your steel t steel throwing blades, feel free. Pretty rough start they give me here. I think you have to juggle them in the air. Maybe that's where turbo would come in handy. Just hold down the button and wiggle left and right. Yeah, if you can if you can hit them twice. Wow. And then just so rude. <laughs> Alright. I gotta figure the out ninjas where... are so much worse in this game than they were in the NES version. If you can hit them once, you can hit them twice. Uh, usually... Wiping them out. Oh man, his... I was trying to duck under it. I hadn't actually had to dodge one of those yet. I'm nearly defeated here. We're on level... 2 point... Look, this is like halfway through the game. <laughs> once you beat Mandara here, you're halfway through. Oof. We have, uh, we have a couple levels to go. Plus two of five, that's what this is. And he's right around the corner. Yeah, if you don't get like that perfect juggle in midair, it's not gonna die before the other green guy catches up to you. You could use your select, I'm just not sure when I want to, so then it's trying to save it. It might be good at the start, heck. Start seems pretty <laughs> Oh here it is. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? If you have terrain to flip through, maybe that's the ticket. Maybe I should use that more often because it seems like they don't know how to handle me when I'm doing that stuff. The ninja weakness. Flares. <laughs> Floors. Ninjas have always been powerful in two dimensions. In three dimensions, however, not so great. Oh boy, I'm almost there, but they respawned more of them, they're not even dead! You can't respawn when you're not dead, you bastards! <sighs> I'm gonna try, I'm gonna run for it. <laughs> this is working pretty well. Oh, I wish you could jump on them. But yeah, that works, that's the ticket right there. I've already figured out this stage. Just bolt, use the background when you can. Ooh, look at the world record. I think that's the ticket there, probably. Those guys are in the way too much. Ah, The green one. I think that's my last life. Unfortunately, I was getting somewhere with that. I wanted to beat one more boss, but uh, that's our game. Gonna take a little practice, but uh, again, practice won't take long. It'll, it'll just be a matter of time until we clear this, and uh, knowing where those ninjas are is gonna be helpful. Let's watch this guy play. He knows what he's doing. Please show me some ninja strategy. Watch the demo for tips. I noticed that the ninjas are defenseless once they've jumped over you, if you're behind them. He got stabbed. He didn't teach me much. <laughs> there is a world record to watch, though. Ah, uh, that's our game. And we have a race next week, so feel free to hop in, folks. That's, uh, that's our format race, uh, big race in four weeks. Uh, the timer on screen is wrong. Obviously, because it's zeroed out, we're going to set that after the show tonight. I got a game on. The world record looks like it's got some clever stuff in it. Um, you know, not, not unbeatable by any stretch of the imagination, but um, definitely a good place to start. I would, yeah. I would definitely recommend checking that out to start. Yeah, I found a. I mean, there's definitely something to the hopping back and forth. The ninjas are—they're like 
They reminded me of red armors almost. They're just these things that they have some kind of AI behind them that is annoying, but only if they get you in a certain way. Ooh, those guys have knives. <laughs> I didn't know that. Uh, well, thanks for joining me, Alpha Blues. That's our game. Yep. I'm playing uh, a bounty that I have here, so let me get started All on right. that. Stick around, folks. Enjoy. See you later, Alpha Blues.